So they still got the Bordeaux ones in here. I'm at um, Men's Closet dropping my, my toys off. It's not a guaranteed ticket, but it allows you to get an option to get the, the shoes, fill out a raffle. So currently I got two raffles in here in Shoe Palace. But anyways, they got these Bordeaux for 170. What size is this? This is a size eight, I believe, in kids. And I'll also tell you, they got these joints right here too as well. They're still available, man. If y'all looking for a pair, I'm not sure what sizes they have. There is 150. And also got the green, gray, and white joints, which I do not have. These are nine and a half. They got the Ossidians, which is the first place. This is actually the first place I actually seen these joints before I saw them in the outlet. Um, I saw a guy pull up and was copping these before release. <laughs> um, what else? Oh, they got these joints here. The overpriced 13 lows, man. I'm not mad at the color. I like the color, the island green. Uh, $200 is the price for this. And they also got the sale joints, the sale five. This is a huge size though. This is a size 13. If y'all care for it, if y'all wear this size, there you go. So there's a few Jordans still available, man, sitting on the wall. These are still here. The paint on swoosh, splatter paint. They're still available, 13s. Bordeaux, man, I already got two pairs. I right, triple up. <laughs> Out it no, i'm good so i just left men's closet fill out the raffle wish me luck y'all wish me luck getting these pants is tough man this is gonna be one of the toughest shoes i attempted to get in a long time and this is the last spot i can go to to attempt to severe to severe I hope i persevere persevere um the last spot i can go to to fill out a raffle in person with the hopes to get a shoe because everything else is uh, systematic. You gotta go on the Flex app, you gotta go on sneakers, you gotta go on DTLR when it drops, uh, Jimmy Jazz, all that good stuff, man. So I got two in-store raffles going on, Shoe Palace and Men's Closet. So your boy's hoping, at least I get a call back from one of those two. And I mentioned the vlog the other day where I said, yo, bring a toy and you can get reserve a pair. It's actually not reserve a pair. You just donated to the toy drive, man. So they do good things, man. They do give back to the community. They did a backpack drive back in August, I believe, of this year. And they're doing a toy drive for um, the kids uh, in needs of, of gifts and whatnot for Christmas. So that's a good thing. So I donated everything. Even though it's not a guarantee, I donated everything I had all the toys I had from last year and this year, man. So I hope it paid forward. Not like I want that to be a reason why I win the shoe, but I hope it helps someone else. Anyways, um, I'm I'm in the close vicinity of the mall, which is the Dead Mall, West Oaks Mall. If y'all know, if y'all from Orlando, y'all know, ain't really much going on in there. But we gotta make it popping anyways, man. There's three shoe stores, so let's see. Let's pull up and let's vlog. About pulling Champ Sports and see what's popping, yeah. The mall is quiet in the mug. What's up? Hello. I'm right. This mall is quiet. Puma joints, Adidas joints, MDs, R1 V2s. Okay. And they got me white as well. Now, I haven't seen this. This boost look different. It's for 119. That's a little bit different, ain't it? They got the slides. Puma slides or what do you call these? Comfies? Puma comfies? <laughs> 40 beans. Uh, Air Maxes. Harachis. Vapor Max. More Harachis. Some Prestos in the building. Some Kyries. More Crocs on this side. I don't see no J's though. Yeah, there was absolutely nothing in Champs, y'all. Not a damn thing. Anyways, we got two other spots to go to. Jimmy Jazz and Foot Locker. So let's pull in the Foot Locker first, man. Um, Jimmy Jazz is right behind me. But I'm gonna go out of order real quick. Oh, this shoe faked me out. I thought it was a six. <laughs> I thought this was a six, y'all. Um, another wannabe six. Lightning slides. This is a Jordan section right here. Now, I haven't seen these Ultra Boosts in a minute, yo. I call them the Iron Sheik Ultra Boosts. Cause that, look how the, the toe area <laughs> curls, yo. But I feel like these are old. 80 beans. Not bad. These Grand Hills are different. Feli. I don't remember having that joint on the side. That's different. CX. Grand Hills. Now these are the original ones right here. 150. Last stop. Jimmy Jazz. 
Oh yeah, they got the um, purple silver bullets in the building. Forrest Gump joints. Still need a pair of these right here. Fire. So the Griffey's went on sale for 109. But I feel like everyone that wanted them should already have them. Yeah. What about these joints, the red guns? 80 beans, not bad. That's actually the cheapest I've seen them. No retro and men's, but they got them in kids though. The royalty 12s, black and white with a little bit of gold hits. That's dope. They got the pine green threes. That's cool. I have a pair of these. They got the electric orange one high OGs. That's dope to see a pair of ones is available. This look like a size five, maybe, maybe smaller. Then they got the 13s, obviously. And then they get slimmer. Like the ones. And then more ones. I actually tried to get this pair in New York, but the biggest they had was a size 10 and a half. And the biggest size they got here is a six. Oh, this is actually a six. I thought it was smaller, but it's actually bigger than what I thought it is. Okay, Junior's is 6.5 to seven. Okay, makes sense. All right, we in the Superstars area, so you already know Adidas. These ain't shaking anything. Yo, it's been a minute since I see a pro model anywhere. I remember I used to like these back in the days. I used to find them in Adidas outlets. Um, you got the classic joints for 40 beans. That's dope. Yo, what is an MND if I prime knit pass? Yo, the price is good, but it's not prime knit. So, hard pass for me. I actually like these joints right here as well. They remind me of ones. I guess that's the reason why I like them. More pro, pro models for cheaper. And then Champion, I'm not sure who's rocking those. And then you got a whole bunch of Pumas, BMW joints, motorsports, 60 beans for those. Um, more Pumas, Pumas. Ah, oh, man. That's it, y'all. It's a wrap. Oh, these threw me out. They threw me off for a bit. <laughs> these threw me off. I thought there were um, the Midnight Navies or the Japan, the Japan joints. Oh, I forgot to show you guys these. I actually like these, but I like the green one a little bit better, man. These are Reggie Miller's Air Max. What are they actually called? Max of Tempos. They're cool. And a whole bunch of uh, Air Maxes for 99 and Prestos for 119 If y'all care to know. All right, I'm out of here. It's a wrap. Leaving Jimmy Jazz, man. I'm about to take it back to the crib. I don't really come on this side of town too often, especially since the climate has changed to getting sneakers, so there's no really real reason to venture over here. But while I was in the area, man, going to the men's closet, I was like, yo, let me pull up and see what they got to offer. Um, it's crazy that they had a whole bunch of retro sitting for the youth, though. Not adults, man, but for the youth. So unfortunately, couldn't buy anything. I forgot to mention in the last couple of vlogs. I don't know how it slipped my mind. Actually, it never slipped my mind. I just never got around to saying what I wanted to say, man. And what I wanted to say was why I don't have the Air Jordan 1 collection video up and popping. My monitor died. Sadly, this is the reason why I can't get my Air Jordan 1 collection video up. I can't. My monitor's broken, man. So right now, ship it off to be repaired or possibly replaced. That happened a few days ago, me shipping it off, but the issue happened several weeks back. I just got around to shipping it off yesterday. That said, as soon as I get that monitor back, I'll go ahead and edit that video and be on and popping. Also, the interview I did with the young ladies at SneakerCon. I know you guys, if you're still watching the channel, I promise you when I get my monitor back, I'm going to edit your guys' videos as well and I have it on the channel, man. So there's a lot of content that was on this computer. It's not the computer that's messed up or damaged or, or problematic. It's the monitor. So I have a Mac Mini. It's my, my desktop computer is what I use. And I use my BenQ 32-inch monitor to edit off of. Well, if you don't have a TV in a sense to see what you're doing, you can't edit. And I have no other monitors to connect it to. I'm still getting these videos up and popping because I got my trusted old MacBook M1 right here, man. It's a 13 inch. Would love to get the 14 inch as well. Hopefully, hopefully this year, possibly next year. I don't think it's gonna happen this year. But that's what I'm using right now to edit. And when I travel, I'll take that with me. But the meat and potatoes, the main editing machines, that M1 Mac Mini, man, and I can't do anything. And all the footage is held hostage to that Mac Mini because it needs that monitor to operate. That said, that's the reason why the Air Jordan 1 collection video is not up as we speak. I'm supposed to have it up by Thanksgiving, but 
I digress. Anyways, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Your boy already did his work. He put the raffles in at Shoe Palace, and I just did one today at Men's Closet. So pray to the gods, the sneaker gods, that I get a pair from one of those locations, and then I hit on sneakers or whatever opportunity I have to get a pair, man. So the chase continues, man. It's not over until Saturday morning. Saturday morning, man. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. If you're new to this channel, like what you just saw, hit that like, hit that subscribe, hit that notification bell as well. And everyone, keep leaving your comments down below and your boy get back to you as soon as possible. Until then, until we meet again, you already know my slogan. Good to go. It's a wrap. Peace.